Buari should be arrested and dragged into the back of a police van. A man of peace said. Following the call by the People Democratic Party PDP asking President Mohamed Buhari to resign over his failed administration, the Imam of Peace has said Buhari shouldn't resign. He should be arrested and dragged into the back of a police van and locked up. According to the Imam of Peace, this corrupt person freed thousands of Boko people terrorists because they repented. They are now massacring Christians. Adding voice to the call for arrest Buari Reno Omokri via his Twitter handle said General Mohamed Buari refused to send an evacuation plane to rescue Nigerians from South Africa during the xenophobic attacks. Yet he sent a plane to Niger to repatriate repentant Boko people members to Nigeria in style. Because of this, I fully support his arrest. For the murderous activity of headsmen, bandits, and other militias, without his government doing anything really tangible to put an end to these killings of innocent Nigerians, but rather making excuses for them, I fully support his arrest. Mazi Namdekano supports the arrest of President Momo Buari via his Twitter handle. He said, Why many people representing communities in the government are doing nothing about the ongoing genocide in the zoo, Nigeria? People with a conscience like Imam of Peace are speaking out to arrest Buari. Now you can understand that the zoo has fallen. Arrest Buari, arrest Buari. The people lament. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you for listening to this news. My viewers, it's worth laughing, laughing, laughing at. You see, if you decide to, um, to, take your statistics to weigh the number of persons that want the president to be arrested you will see that half of this country even more than half of this country we we put up their hands mm -hmm. that it should be arrested i'm talking about nigeria what about the international country in fact, more than half as well. Don't be surprised that even the President of the United States will even succumb and, sec and second to, to his arrest. Why? Because he has not been doing anything, anything to help salvage the problems we are facing in this country. I said it before that President Mulberry is a type that doesn't bother consigning what the masses are going through. In one of my video, it was it was it was seen seen being very very comfortable. Someone commented saying that he he, he is adding the, the president Mulberry is adding is adding weight. Why is he adding weight? Why won't he add weight when nothing concerning this country ever bothered him? ever troubled him when he's not even bothered or troubled concerning what is going on or happening in the country when what he only thinks about is himself and what and what he, he, he is going to be with Hapa, nigerians for how long do we continue to nurse these pains in our hearts it is better we come out in mass and speak up. If we keep nursing this pain because we are afraid of 
being jailed or, 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 or locked up in prison because we know that this president is a kind of president that doesn't like pe people talking to him or people harassing him. If you harass him, he will lock you up. So if we, we decide to, to remain mute and refuse to say anything because we are afraid, my viewers will keep suffering and dying silently. So we have to speak up. We have to stand up. We have to stand upright and speak up. We need to say no to this to 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 to, to this intimidation. You understand? President Mobari has really dealt with us, so we should say no to this. You understand? So, my viewers, without saying much. I will tell you that the whole, the, in fact, more than half of Nigerians are in support of the president's arrest, aside from the Imam of Peace. I want to really, really commend this Imam of Peace. Despite that he's a Muslim, despite the fact that he is a, he, 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 he is a, a um, a promoter of Islam is still decide to stand by the side of the truth. You understand? He still decide to stand by the side of the truth, not minding what what the president is going to say or do to him. He kept telling him the truth, no matter what. What can be as good as saying? The saying, saying, saying the truth to the president. If you like, you should take it. If you like, you should drop it. That is it. The earlier we start telling him the truth, the better for us. Because if we don't tell the president the truth, he will keep doing what he's doing. He will be feeling that what he's doing is very okay. So Nigerians are very comfortable with it. So we must not... We, we, we have to come out and speak up. We have to come out and and say our minds. Let us let the president know that we are not we are, we are not comfortable with with a system of government. Let us make him to know that we are not comfortable with his leadership. His leadership system is is drawing us backward. Is 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 killing us silently. Is killing us and making us. To, 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 uh, to experience setbacks. For how long do we continue to experience all of this? For how long? Enough is enough, my viewers. We have to say no to this, to this mess. We have to say no to this shit. We have been too much been pushed to the wall. You understand? So let us not accept this any longer. Let us not accept it. Alright? So my viewers, I want to urge you to please come into this issue. Your comments concerning this issue are of great importance. Don't forget to leave them behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.